Welcome back to Fox 43 AM Live. He's touring across the country and he'll be in Manhattan, Kansas, June 17th for Red Dirt Saturday at a &H Farm. Please welcome Brandon Davis. Good morning. How's it going? Very good. Happy to have you on the show today. I'm very excited to talk to you. Um, you know, to start off, let, let's talk about the summer coming up here. You, I know you're traveling around across the country. Where are you right now? What, what are you up to? Man, right now we're in preparation for probably the biggest event here around the local area that I grew up with in Chattanooga, which is our festival called Riverbend. So we've been prepping for that show, super excited. And we've got so many tour stops coming across the country this year that we're just really looking forward to, including coming to good old Kansas. How, yeah, how far reaching is your uh, tour this summer? Where all are you going? Man, we are, uh, we're going from here to Iowa to South Dakota. Uh, shoot, we're going to be traveling down to Florida. We've got some shows up near Maryland, New York, so a little bit everywhere. That must be exciting, especially you just mentioned that you're, you're in your hometown. Is that right? Yes, sir. And this is kind of a milestone for me because I, I got to watch Merle Haggard do this back in 2015, and this was always one of the shows to be at. This was the place to come to to hear the artists that might not normally come to this area to play a big show and to know that I get to grace the same the same stage and play to the crowd that I grew up with and also draw in hopefully some new folks that haven't heard me, it's just an honor. I understand you've been singing and songwriting f from childhood, is that right? But professional singing as you're doing now is kind of newer in your life. Yeah, I mean, my dad showed me a love and a passion for music at an early age because he's he's done it all his life. He's done gospel music, country music, same with my mom and papa. And it just kind of runs in the family, but it got to where, you know, I, I loved it so much. I sang with a family band for years, but never knew how to turn a hobby into something that I could actually do for a living. And it, it took a while to actually put that in perspective and find the right avenue. So at this point now, you have so many songs in your belt at this point. Do you have a favorite out there? I'm, I'm par pretty partial to Jesus and Jesse James. Man, my favorite's always going to be Step by Step. It's It's got that special place in my heart just because that's the song about me and my oldest two kids. And it's not only just my story. There's so many people that have reached out and told me that it's their story. It's something that touches them because it's a situation that they're in or they watch, you know, their kids find that person to love them for the rest of their life. And it's just, it's amazing to me how far a song can spread and how many people it can bring together. You're touring now. What do you have plans for even the future? Are there is there another album on the way? What do you got in the works? Man, we've got so much music. We honestly don't know what to do with it, and that's a good thing. And there's a lot of stuff that I want to try to release before the end of this year. So I'm not going to allude to exactly what's coming down the pike, but there might be another album. There's definitely going to be more singles, and then we're still writing every week. So there's more songs to come. That's probably the longest short of it. Cannot wait. And now looking at Red Dirt Saturday coming up on in June, what can people expect from you? What do you got lined up for the, for the show that day? We have got a lot of the songs that you've been hearing that have come out since the beginning of this year, like See You In It, one of those, Jesus and Jesse James, Lightning in a Mason Jar. But there's also going to be some of the favorites that people have heard from the past couple of years of what we've released, as well as some stuff that people haven't heard yet at all. Oh. So I'm very excited to share those. All right, that's, that's going to be a great concert then. Some new stuff. I cannot wait. It's been a pleasure talking with you today. Thank you for joining us. I cannot wait to see you at the concert on June 17th. And everybody, be sure to follow Brandon across social media and at brandondavismusic.com and see him live in Manhattan June 17th at A&H Farms for Red Dirt Saturday. Brandon, thank you again. This has been fantastic. Absolutely. It's been an honor getting to be a part of it, and we're looking forward to it.